Good morning. Now let's open our English booklet to page 24. Have we all found page 24? Very good. Let's begin by writing the date on the top right hand corner, okay? So, yesterday was the 11th. What comes after 11? What date is it today? Excellent. The 12th. And which month are we in? Very good. April. April is the fourth month. So, 12, 4. Very good. Today we are doing lesson 28. Now, let's read the sight words that we've been learning. Who can read this word for me? Look. Very good. Look. Look. There. There. Very good. Out. Out. Who can read this word? So. So. Very. Very. Now this is a word we use often. Very. Very. Put. 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 Excellent. Now we know the words inside our box. Remember these are sight words. We look at the word and we learn them. Very good. Now we are going to use the we are going to choose one sight word and use it in a sentence. So, look at the sentence. What is the sight word in the sentence that we learned? Who can spot the sight word in this sentence and read it for me? Well done. Look. Look. Now, we have to write. We have to read the and print the sentence three times. Okay, so let's read the sentence. This is a sight word that we learned before. Excellent! You! You! Very good! You look! A sight word we learned today also. Very! Excellent! You look very nice. You look very nice. Which two sight words did we learn today from this sentence? Very good. Look and very. We learned look and very. And this is how we use it in a sentence. You look very nice. Now we need to write the sentence. We need to rewrite the same sentence down three times. Okay. But first let's look how the sentence is written. What do we begin with? When writing a sentence, what do you begin a sentence with? Excellent. Capital letter. Whenever we begin writing a sentence, we always begin with a capital letter. What do I have to keep between the words when I'm writing? Excellent. A spacing. One finger spacing. Keep your finger and keep one finger spacing between the words very good. What do I put at the end of my sentence? Yes, a period. This is a period. It shows that the sentence is finished. It's also called a full stop. So we begin with a capital letter and we end with a period. Excellent. Now, are you ready to write our sentences? Excellent. We are going to write it three times. One, two, and three times. Okay? And we are going to write the same sentence. Now, remember, we have to write between the lines. Okay? We are not going to go under the golden line. Unless we have a root letter, like the letter Y goes under the line. When we are writing a lowercase Y, it goes under the line. Let's start writing. Remember we start with a capital letter. U, a finger spacing between each word. 
the sight word that we learned look finger spacing very another sight word that we learned now remember lowercase y is a root letter it will go under the line you look very nice now what do I need to add at the end of my sentence a period now you will write it again in line number two and line number three now let's look over here read the story we have to identify we have to look and circle the sight words so we have to look for the sight words and when we find and locate the sight words we have to circle them now let's go over the sight words that we learned look out very there so put we need to find these sight words in our story and when we find these sight words we are going to circle them so let's read our story Layla is a vet she is very kind with pets so can you see a sight word that we learned excellent very she looks after them can you spot a sight word that we learned good look she put food in their bowl can you spot a sight word or maybe more than one sight word that we learned in the sentence very good put and there excellent she puts food in their bowl and feeds them she is a very good fat can you spot a sight word that we learned excellent very now on page 25 you are going to complete it as homework okay page 25 is homework you need to write three full sentences using some of the sight words that we have learned on the topic rows you're going to write three sentences on the topic rows for example you could say look at the rose the rose is very beautiful so you use the sight words that we learned to make sentences about a rose very good over here you need to rearrange the words to create a correct sentence look at we the art is that a correct sentence no saw the boy the toys is that a correct sentence does that sound correct to you no you are going to rearrange the words put them in order to make a correct sentence okay remember to always begin with a capital letter our sentences begin with capital so we and then continue putting the words in order to make a proper sentence